This, if you're a fan like me, you'll agree that Police Squad is among the best TV series ever. So do you want to join me today? Grab a chair, sit by the campfire, and we'll live this great show together. We'll travel through the entire cast, past and present, reminiscing about those who have left us and celebrating those who still shine. Are you ready? Let's dive in and rekindle some incredible memories. William Conrad played the character Stubman in the series when he was 62 in 1982. Sadly, on February 11, 1994, he left us due to a heart attack at 73 in Los Angeles, California, USA. We're deeply saddened by his passing. Star William Conrad. He, being supposedly the brightest of all intellectual detectives uh, puts everything together and solves. Barbara Tarbuck played the character Mrs. Twice in the series when she was 40 years old in 1982. Sadly, on December 26, 2016, she left us due to a degenerative neurological disease at the age of 74 in Los Angeles, California, USA. We're deeply saddened by her passing. Please go away. I don't want to answer any more of your questions. I was sorry to bother you at a time like this, Mrs. Twice. Behind it all, because they've got all sorts of clues set up for people who take the tour to figure out and try to solve problems. And it, sh it should be real. Alan North played the character Captain Ed Hawken in the series when he was 62 in 1982. Sadly, on January 19, 2000, he left us due to lung and kidney failure at 79 in Port Jefferson, New York, USA. We're deeply saddened by his passing. Never got a note. <laughs> I know this is a long shot, but did he ever eat chop suey? I know. No, he never did. It was just a hunch. I t I'm naked and unconscious in laundromats over on the east side. Unfortunately, I was assigned to investigate neighborhood credit unions. Lon Green played the character Stabman in the series when he was 67 in 1982. Sadly, on September 11, 1987, he left us due to pneumonia at 72 in Santa Monica, California, USA. We're deeply saddened by his passing. Special guest star, Lorne Green. Show, right? Oh, yes. So the, the, there's the family interaction of the... The, the, the familial uh, firefighters and the Leslie Nielsen played the character Detective Frank Drebin in the TV series when he was 56 in 1982. Sadly, on November 28, 2010, he left us due to pneumonia at 84 in Fort Lauderdale, Florida, USA. We're deeply saddened by his passing. You'll be able to look in the mirror and see a winner. You've been living in the dumps too long, pal. I'm gonna help you and Mary get out of this sewer. Come on. And you never can tell when there's a, a certain amount of pomposity or somebody who's making you play a particular role and you, if you just shake hands with someone. Peter Lupus played the character Norberg in the series when he was 50 years old in 1982. See, at the age of 91, he is living a fulfilling life full of passion right here in Indiana, USA. Found this on the curb next to the car. Club Flamingo. I think we better have a talk with Emerald ring with a diamond in the center. So we went back to the love boat yeah. and we had the captain's table and we had something to eat that night. Right. And we pulled that ring out. It was, I didn't. Nicholas Custer played the character Warner in the series when he was 49 in 1982. Sadly, on June 26, 2023, he left us of natural causes at 89 in Hallandale Beach, Florida, USA. We're deeply saddened by his passing. You raise the ransom money? I have it right here. Good. I'm getting nervous, Lieutenant. Time is running out for my little girl. I've got to know. Finding people who saw the show three days ago, what happened three days ago uh, in the le next two days. And so you have all this kind of repair. Florence Henderson played the character Short Woman in the series when she was 48 in 1982. Sadly, on November 24, 2016, she left us due to illness at 82 in Los Angeles, California, USA. We're deeply saddened by passing. Tonight's 
special guest star, Florence Henderson. Tonight's episode. Visions as well as you, and they have the vision for the big picture. So I try to be aware of, you know, what is their vision for this? William Shatner played the character Poison Man in the series when he was 51 in 1982. See, at the age of 92, he's living a fulfilling life full of passion right here in Quebec, Canada. Star Trek. And well, I had been at NASA a year before, and they had, uh, I, I laid down on the, on the vehicle. Joyce Brothers played the character Dr. Joyce Brothers in the series when she was 55 in 1982. Sadly, on May 13, 2013, she left us due to respiratory failure at 85 in Fort Lee, New Jersey, USA. We're deeply saddened by passing. I've been getting a lot of mail about the Cinderella complex. So? When the queue was coming, <laughs> you were in mid-thought and mid-sentence. Why don't you pick up there? I started to talk about the autocratic boss versus the empathetic boss, the boss who can put... Robert Gillette played the executed man in the series when he was 49 in 1982. Sadly, on October 30th, 2007, he left us due to pulmonary fibrosis at 73 in Los Angeles, California, USA. We're deeply saddened by passing. Ready! Aim! Fire! Oh. Why did you want to be a part of the theater? Oh, I never wanted to be. When I was a kid, my father on his deathbed said, you have a voice, you must sing. And that's the only reason I went into this business. I didn't want to... Ed Williams played the character Mr. Olsen in the series when he was 56 in 1982. See, at the age of 97, he's living a fulfilling life full of passion right here in California, USA. Notice, complete destruction. Right up to the point where she asked Catherine Hepburn what kind of tree she'd like to be. William Duo played the character Johnny in the TV series when he was 59 in 1982. Sadly, on December 22, 2011, he left us due to respiratory failure at the age of 88 in Manhattan, New York, USA. We're deeply saddened by his passing. At this address. Thanks, Johnny. Okay, let's chat. Who is your favorite character in Police Squad? Please comment and share interesting things below this video. And as always, show some love. Hit the like button, subscribe to know more, and hit the bell to never miss my new content. I can't wait to create more wonderful memories with you. Thanks so much and stay tuned for more. See you again as soon as possible.